The global terrorist threat is constantly evolving, but what we've seen in recent times is terrorist groups working together, exchanging information, collaborating. So what were once isolated groups now are far more dangerous because of that knowledge spread. Interpol's the only organisation bringing 190 member countries from around the world together to make one platform where we can address these threats. That's probably more important than it's ever been in this globalised environment. What the conference has done over the last three days is bring over 270 participants together from over 120 countries. So Interpol is really providing a global platform where these experts can come together and build strategies that transcend borders. As we know, criminals, terrorists, borders are becoming more meaningless every day to them. So essentially, this is the only strategy that I think in the long term can be successful. This Interpol conference builds towards the Global Nuclear Summit that's going to take place at the end of March in Washington. This is one of a series of events uh, from different disciplines bringing together knowledge, in this case from law enforcement professionals, about investigating nuclear smuggling or responding to incidents and, and operations to bring that expertise together. So when the 52 leaders from around the globe meet at the end of March in Washington, they'll be in the best position possible to make good recommendations and decisions about the way to counter this threat.